All right, so we're gonna look at a couple new products from Backyard Broadheads, one for Raven crossbows and one for Tacticam cameras. Also, we're gonna look at two Broadheads, one I will definitely be using this year and one I might use. Um, either way, I do wanna do a video testing them out. I tried to do a video the other day, but my bolts were getting just too stuck in the target. It was at 50 yards that was using my Zombie Slayer bolt. Sorry, there's a bee flying around in here. That was with the Zombie Slayers. My next step was either either to go further or to put silicone on them, and I don't want silicone on my hunting arrows, so I'm gonna try to do a video with Raven arrows with silicone on them so I can get them out of the target at maybe 60 yards. Also, on my Raven Knox, they are tighter on the string, and I'm not recommending this, but I'm gonna sand them a little bit so they're not so tight on the string, but I still want them to be very smooth because I don't want them to be abrasive when I snap them onto the serving. All right, checking out the products now. So this is the newest hanger guard from back here, Broadheads. It's the Heart Drop Subatomic. So that's what it looks like on the front of the crossbow. If you have it on the R10, it will stick out like this, but you still have protection for it. And, you know, it comes with this page and color instructions on the back. When it's mounted onto the crossbow, it will be up under the riser. It won't be exactly right there. It'll be down eight millimeters for your arrow clearance. It also has a little bit of clearance bent into it also. And you won't have metal on metal contact. It comes with plastic washers for that. Same thing on the top, plastic washers and spacers on the top. All the hardware is over here. Um, stainless steel screws, nylock nuts. There's the washers I was talking about. And as far as the broadheads that I want to test out, and then we'll go over to this product here. So this is my favorite broadhead. Rage slip cam with an O-ring. No plastic shock collar. Very, very much shoots the same as field tips, and you get a gigantic hole in the deer about that wide every time. Now I have done accuracy tests with these before, SWAT crossbow broadheads, and they were extremely accurate. So I wanna test them again uh, this year. I mean, with this, you're getting, you know, an extra little blade up here and two extra blades on the side. So you get these two blades that open up inside the deer and these two that will open up before they go in. Now, as far as for your Tacticam cameras, uh, you can see this is the tactic cap hatch flip up cover and it's got the back here broadheads logo and info on the front and then on the inside of it when you open it up it has a reminder for you of what each color is on your tactic cam so that purple for zoom yellow for regular light blue for slow motion and i think believe this fits the 3.0 4.0 and 5.0 other stuff for your Ravens. Heart Drop 5 and 1, most Raven crossbows. This is for the R500. 500 quick, uh, 500 quick detach. It comes off with just two wing nuts so you can fit it into a case. And the uh, Heart Drop 5 and 1 R26 for the Raven R26 or the uh, R26X or the R5X. That's the stuff from Backyard Broadheads. Thanks for watching.